A church's mission should really not be unique compared to all of the other churches around it. If we are all following the same God and believe in the same Jesus and are reading the same Bible, then we should be extrapolating the same purposes for what the church should be. Now, every church has its own personality and its own identity and interpretations. And so within there, there might be some things that one church will champion over another or favor uh, or will be skewed towards. Uh, we are trying our best to have a very balanced approach and so not to take one thing that Jesus says or that the Bible contains and say this is our single mission, uh, but to look at a lot, all of the things that the Bible says and say well, how many of those apply to the church and who we are supposed to be and what we're supposed to be doing to please God. And it starts with loving God with all of your heart and all of your soul and all of your strength and all of your mind and that is what Jesus says is the greatest command that we have. Next to that is loving your neighbors as yourself. And so those are the two things that we are to do as the church. Now as we go on, we see uh, other commands, uh, instructions by Christ, and examples in his own life. And I'm going to use the next couple of videos to go and explain our fourfold approach to the mission of the church. Now we do have banners in the front and back of the church building that look very similar to this. And these are the four things that we'll focus on. Connect, grow, serve, and go. So connect, grow, serve, and go. Uh, and that's what we'll talk about as far as how we are trying to live out the mission and purpose of the church as a collective, a uh, collection of people trying to follow Jesus, and also as individuals.